trying to obviously have a consistent car um, out here in Vegas and uh, it was great you know going down we didn't really have anything to lose on that last run we knew that we were already in the show and um, we just wanted to see what our Jackson Ford Mustang could do on that last pass and we just kind of had it going as quick as we could ran a 414 and it had us in at the number two spot got, got bumped down a couple of positions but Definitely happy with where I'm at and excited to go into the race tomorrow. When they're telling me, you know, you went 309 at 4.14 seconds, I was excited. I mean, I knew it was a good pass, and uh, it's tough out here with these conditions in Vegas, so I'm happy that we uh, were able to kind of overcome that and do well. Tomorrow, it's supposed to cool down. The track's going to cool down, so hopefully these cars will be running a lot quicker. I like it better when it's cool outside. I mean, better, better conditions, uh, better for the racetrack, and better for the cars. So that means uh, we'll have quicker runs tomorrow, hopefully, and... Uh, Hopefully we'll see some some fast runs. Probably better for you too in that driving suit. Definitely, yeah. It cools down a lot more when you're in this. Well, talk about a lot of your crew guys. I know they all have a specific function on the team. How is it working with a bunch of men? It's it's been great. I mean, obviously building a team from scratch and getting these group of guys together. Um, some of them from various teams, and some of them uh, weren't on a team before this. So it's definitely. Um, it was definitely, you know, a challenge to get everyone to figure out how to work together, but these guys picked it up fast, and uh, it's great to have them on board. And with Ron Douglas as my crew chief, I was familiar with working with him all last year uh, during testing. So these guys are doing a great job. They're good at what they do, and, uh, you know, I, I have to trust them with my life, and, and obviously I do. I mean, I, I get this car going down that racetrack, and uh, they make me feel safe in it. It's definitely easy, obviously, to talk to any of my crew guys, but... Um, especially when you have someone on the team that's a brother-in-law that you're used to being around all the time, uh, used to picking on, and he'll pick on me. So he, he'll, he'll be brutally honest with me if I screw up as a driver. So it's nice to have that. I, I mean, I need, I need someone to tell me if I do something wrong. I need to know so I can fix it. And uh, it, it's definitely fun. I mean, it, it uh, throws a little bit more of a mix into the team, and uh, it's just fun.